With the recent release of the Quest 3, VR Rock have sent me some new prescription lenses to check out. So today we'll be doing a quick review, having a look at their ease of install, whether they impact comfort or position of the headset, etc. And just a general look at their overall quality. So with that said, let's jump in for a closer look. Okay, so the lenses come in this protective hard shell case. I mean, if you really give it a go, you can squeeze it in, but yeah, it is very nice and protective and comes with a rather excessive but awesome zip pull. So let's have a look. Okay, so two lenses. Now they look like one piece per eye, but in fact, these are the magnetic ones. So these are pretty awesome. It's two pieces per eye and one you just leave in permanently. So let's just take out one. We don't need to look at both. They're obviously the same. For the magnetic lenses, these ones are like $30 more and the price varies. I can't give you a, a complete price because it changes depending on your prescription, the options you choose on the website. But see, it looks like one piece, but in fact, there we go, they're two pieces. So this piece, which has no lens in it, we shall install into the headset. And as you can see, it's got an L. I don't know how easy you can see. There's an L there. Obviously for left, and uh, let's grab the Quest 3. Now I've taken out the facial interface just to make this easier. So it's so just a question of getting it in the right spot and pushing it in. And that's it, it's clipped in. Don't know if you heard the clip, but that is it, it's nice and in. So that's me trying to just grab it and pull it off. I mean, you can get your finger under it and flip it off. So uh, that's done. So yeah, you do that on both eyes, obviously. Well, you don't have to. You might only need um, correction for one eye. And then that's it. This is your prescription lens. Magnets on. So say you're sharing this headset with someone who doesn't need prescription lenses. Well, there you go. Just take that off. The other bit stays on. Put this in its protective case. Job done. Or, of course, you may be sharing it with people who have other prescription lenses. Well, again, you just swap them over. So simple as that. Take them off and swap them over. And you can just leave this bit in. You can buy the non-magnetic ones. As I say, you save yourself $30. I and mean, then that's more just to fit in once and forget. You could swap them over if you wanted. But obviously, this is just more ease of use, you know, straight away. And that bit is nice and secure. Okay, so I've been having a play with the lenses in. Uh, this, by the way, is the Zyber VR Elite head straps. Pretty awesome. I've done a review on that. But if I flip the back up, you can see the lenses there are in place. And they look very much at home in the Quest 3. Almost look like they're just part of the Quest. But, of course, I can reach in and take out a lens. You would do this more carefully so you don't get fingerprints on it like I am right now. But, yeah, you can see in the magnet part just stays in there. So if I need to put that away, if I don't need a lens or I need to swap to another one, Simple as that. Now, if I need to put the lens back in, again, you would do this more carefully because you're not worrying about doing it on camera. I find the easiest way just to hold it flat, grab your lens, and just hold it over and drop it and let the magnets do their job, and it's back in place. Fantastic. Simple as that. Um, now, regarding comfort and um, position of the headset, all I've had to do is move this facial interface um, inwards one notch, just one notch, which really makes uh, minimal or no perceivable difference to FOV. Maybe if I measured both, then you might, but no, I didn't notice any drop in FOV. One notch is barely anything. And of course, if you're going from glasses to prescription lenses, it's a massive bonus anyway. So yeah, that's it. They do their job and they do it very well. Um, if you go on their website, you'll need to know your prescription and uh, drop them all your details in there now your prescription will change the price so it's up to you to put it in and see what it comes out as and here's your choice for the magnetic option like i've got here um 30 uh increase so it's up to you whether that's worth it or whether you just need them to put them in and forget about them so yeah very happy with them now if you are looking to order you don't have to use it but i've got an affiliate link down below but more importantly i've got a coupon code down below for um 10 percent off which you're more than welcome to use um but it's entirely up to you but yeah anyway they get a thumbs up from me 
And that's it, really. Any comments or questions, drop below, and I'll always try to answer. Otherwise, I'll catch you later. Cheers.